Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is episode 128 of my Direwolf 21.18 Let's Play. <laughs> oh man, have I? <laughs> I've been busy. I haven't had as much time today to work uh, to work with. Uh, so I'm hoping I can at least accomplish a little bit today. Um, I have been. Uh, working this area over a little bit, trying to get the incense altar upgraded. Uh, now it looks like uh, the tier of the incense altar is also tied to the tier of your blood altar. Um, I have the wooden paths laid down and the stone paths laid down, uh, but there are two more tiers that I can't get into just yet until I get the fourth and fifth tier of the blood altar. So I can't get the worn stone path until I get the master blood orb, which is uh, tier five. Um, wait a minute, arch mages. Oh, this is the tier four, I must have clicked. Uh, so, yeah, uh, tier four we can't do yet until we go to the demon realm, I think, because the weak blood shard, yeah, you have to have um, the saturated tau. I think, uh, what is this one? Uh, a sanguine reverter. Hmm. Does that mean I could make it without getting the towel? I don't. I don't know. Did that look like it? I think it did. But um, if you make those shears and you whoa, hello, I hit the wrong button. Uh, if you make the shears and you put the master blood orb, but. You have to have had a weak blood shard in order to use that. So you have to have uh, the saturated towel. And that's what you have to go to the demon realm for. Um, which I'm really excited to to do that. But before we do that, we need like to get the sentient sword so we can be gathering will while we're over there battling and stuff. Um, well, at least that would be a little bit more useful. So, um, yeah, I already made the wooden paths, which were just uh, some wood and the orb to make the wooden path. And the stone is uh, any stone and the orb. Uh, these are also tier based, so you have to have uh, those accordingly. So we got those done. And getting a better bonus. For that check it out plus 49 that's up from plus 20 um so that's pretty cool <laughs> and it's given me about 6,000 life points every time but what i want to do is since i'm getting such a big hit every time and it's now um i need 8,000 life points to start the craft <clears throat> And it's really awkward number because it's almost full, but it's not quite. And I don't know. I'd really like to get some runes of capacity, which take the imbued slate, which I went ahead and set up in in the little system over here to go ahead and monitor for the imbued slate and to uh, you know be able to craft it and stuff. Uh, so I went ahead and took a bunch of time and I got a bunch of imbued slate in here so that I can go ahead and make these runes of capacity. So let's do that and see how much that gives us. Um, oh, I'm, I, I didn't tell it to store that in storage drive. There we go. 
Now it should see it. That's the downside to using it that way is that now it's just looking for that specific item. But <clears throat> yeah, what are you going to do? Um, I can use it in my ME system. So I'm happy about that. Why does it say that it's missing? It's in Butte Slate. Okay, what if I take them out? It's in Butte Slate. Mm. Okay, now it's seeing it. What if I do it like that? What did it run out of? Oh, bucket. Um. Yeah, I need I need buckets, 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 buckets. Uh, I thought I had an auto craft for buckets. Uh, I should have been able to control click that. Um, a couple more buckets. buckets. Oh my goodness! I have more buckets. That should be enough for two more. Yes. All right. Um, let's get those down. See how much the altar will hold after. Um, it says it is cumulative and it adds 20% uh, per block. Um, I'm not sure if there's some kind of cap on it. Um, okay. Oh, 26,000. Oh, that is so good. <laughs> I love it. Um, oh, no. Did I destroy something over here? Like 10 miles away. Okay, that's, I'm fine. If if it's further away than that, I'm fine with the block being broken. <laughs> Sweet. So we got 26,000. Uh, that is good. That is good. I like that. So now I can hit it a couple of times. And real quick and fill it up. I really wish it would allow you to be uh as you increase the tier that you also increase the radius of you know the altar where you can stand over here and get the benefits of it but i guess that's just me being lazy it just seems kind of silly to walk back and forth you know so much Boop. Oh yeah, that is good. So we got our runes of capacity. Yay. Um uh, Jake Mo made a comment about the tier five altars. And uh because I made a comment about this is where the beacons go, <laughs> as far as I was concerned, uh like even in the ocean block, I don't no, they didn't have the tier 5 altar implemented in, or they had it implemented, but it didn't actually add anything but the tier 5 altar. So there was really no point in getting the tier 5 altar because um, it didn't it didn't have anything associated with it. Uh, so this block isn't a beacon block anymore. It is now supposed to be this Hellforged block which the Hellforged, um, you get, when you go to the Demon Realm, they have a uh, Demonite Ore, so you basically uh, get the raw Demonite and smelt it, and then you make it into block form, which is the Hellforged block. Uh, and that, you need four of those to do the Tier 5 Altar. So, that uh, that is pretty neat. That is definitely something that has changed from what I remember. Um, 
But yeah, that was literally the part, the next part of the direwolf video that I was on was about that. And, and then I was like, no way. But it actually lists it in the book as, uh, as the, oh, I'm on the path. Oh. Yeah, it's listed as the Hellforged blocks, not the the beacon blocks anymore so that is good and stuff so it's going to be making some more building the imbued slate back up uh which is cool um didn't i have another orb did i put it in here for you to find it I thought I made the Um, yeah, I really need this back. Seventeen thousand. Wow. Man, you can just rack up the points on this super super easy yeah i definitely like having the bigger capacity um let's see okay this is the tier one uh, no i wanted the recipe for it and that's the tier two. Yeah, I am. Did I put it in here? I could have swore I made the tier three. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I didn't. I could have swore that I made the tier three. What? Is it in the system? Ah, it is in the system. Okay. <laughs> My bad. Oh, it's it's on there. It's storing mm -hmm. it. Why didn't it put it in there? That's why I was confused. Because it should have put it in there. Whack. Okay, so. Um, we talked about that. Uh, let's, let's look at trying to... We've got the impute slate, too. Uh, let's try to go to the demon realm. I think that's going to be our next step. Um, let's get this stuff kind of cleaned up. Um, all right, let's look at the book. I don't know why I just put that up. Uh, sleep first. Whoa! Why? Ah! Get to the water. Man, I just emptied my inventory. Okay, let's come up here where you're undisturbed. Um, what was I wanting to do? I want to go to the demon realm. Um... demon will do you think or would it be the rituals i know there's uh we need the ritual diviner that's what it is uh and then we can select the ritual that will get us to the demon realm uh, so ritual diviner i wish there was a way Rituals, getting started. Once you've got your blood altered, tier three, you can delve into the wonderful world of rituals. For working with rituals, you will require the following. An activation crystal. At tier three, only the weak crystal is available. So we need a weak crystal. Weak 
activation crystal. This is what we need right here. Uh, that is made from a uh -huh. Okay, so what else did it say that we needed? We also need a master ritual stone. Every ritual requires exactly one of these at its center. Master ritual stone. Master ritual stone. So there we go with that. Um, enough ritual stones to build the ritual. I don't really know how many it takes yet, so we'll keep that in mind. And we need the Ritual Diviner. Although it's not required, it will make ritual construction significantly easier. Yes, uh, Ritual Diviner is a must in my book. Uh, ritual Diviner. So we need this one, not the desk one just yet. All right, I think that's all we need, except, you know, we'll, we'll need more Ritual Stones. Uh, just don't know how many ritual stones. Uh, oop. Uh, so, yeah, let's put that over there. Wow. Reinforced slate and obsidian. I never got the lava <laughs> situation taken care of. I still don't have a ton of obsidian. Uh, all right. So, we should be able to get these things no problem. Um, but first, let's make the ritual diviner. Look at all these things. Um, it's basically some diamonds, a stick, and these guys. We need a description tool. Fire, earth, water, and air. And those, I think, are pretty simple too. Uh, you just... Uh, a magma cream. So, a uh, magma cream. Don't I have... I bet I don't have any blaze powder in my system. Oh, I do. There we go. A magma cream for that one. Uh, an obsidian for that one. Uh, obsidian. Um, water is a block of lapis. I can definitely do that. Block of lapis. And air is a gas tier. I believe I have gas tier. I do. I do. So we got the stuff for all four pieces. Um, so let's get those cooking. I guess I'll need an empty hand as well. There we go. Come over here. Get a little stabby stabby. There we go. Fire. Doink. <laughs> That's another thing I had to do, uh, was, um, uh, actually go and make some more food because I had completely ran out. Uh, so yeah, I went and made some more shepherd's pie and some stuffed potatoes and some green bee pie because <laughs> I had the stuff for all that. So that was good. Uh, come back here. So let's see if we can make uh, our ritual definer. Yes. Oh, this is good. All right, we got that. Got the ritual definer. Um, uh, the weak activation crystal. 
think that should be able to be done. We need a lava crystal. Whoa, look at all this stuff. Um, here is the thing. I don't have lava buckets set up on like autocraft in my new system, but I do have them autocrafted in my old system over at the dire factory. Um, so maybe I'll get the buckets there because I don't have an infinite lava source and I haven't finished setting it up in the nether. Uh, so Let's do bucket. There we go. I think it was three. Oh, I'm missing iron, <laughs> of course. Um, oh, it's got two buckets in there. I can craft a bucket here. All right, so if I throw these in there, then I should be able to do the thing. I know I need to set all this stuff up again for the new system. All right, now the lava crystal. Oh, I'm missing, missing my orb. Like I don't see how it's missing the orb. I thought it was seeing everything in my system why isn't it seeing my orb i don't i don't understand that see now it's seeing it when it's in my inventory why isn't it seeing it there oh see i don't get that it should be seeing it. Is that like read only or something? It's input output mode. I don't understand why that it sees the other two but not this one. Oh, maybe maybe I listed it put it in here before I bound it to me. So maybe it's the one that was before it was bound to me. So maybe this will help it. Let's see if that would uh I could do it again. No, it's still not seeing it. I don't know what's up with it then. I have no idea. But we got our lava crystal. So now we need to put that guy in there. Look at that. We got 16 more imbued slate. <clears throat> yeah, I have no idea why that is not seeing the stuff and things like it should. Ah, there we go. Weak activation crystal. Check. <laughs> uh, now, every ritual requires a master ritual stone and a certain number of ritual stones. So now we need to find the ritual to get us to the demon realm. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> oh, boy. So, um, which one do we actually need? Does it say? Uh, another thing that I might want to do is to grab, grab my little magician's blood orb and put that in there and maybe get some 
get some blood into my blood network because I only had like a little bit, like 4,900. Yeah, now it's going up. Uh, so that should help get some more in there. If we're going to do a ritual, it's going to require uh, life points from our blood network. So I'm going to go ahead and just leave that in there for a little bit since we have all our slates at the moment. Uh, so let's look at uh, the ritual stones. Oh, they take lots of obsidian. Um, yeah, I really need to find out what the ritual is to get to the demon realm. Rituals getting started. Yeah, that's that's what I was reading. Um, dungeon delving. There we go. Uh, perform the edge of the hidden realm ritual to gain a foothold in the demon realm. Okay, edge of the hidden realm is what we're looking for. Um, so let's get that one. Um, current direction east. Um, edge of the hidden realm. Okay. Summons an inversion pillar, a tenuous gateway to the demon realm. Press shift for extra info. Hold shift plus alt for augment if info. Shift and alt. Okay, shift says we need um, six water runes, ten fire runes, sixteen earth runes, and four air runes. And it says we need a total runes of 36. Oh man, I forgot how much obsidian this takes. Uh, yeah, 36 plus a master ritual stone, which is uh, four ritual stones, would make it 40 ritual stones. And that's a lot of obsidian. Uh, so, let's get... See the re it's not seeing the reinforced slate either. Like I have reinforced slate in there. Uh, maybe if I took all of these guys out, it would start seeing it again. Is that just is that messing it up? No, it's still not seeing them. It's uh it's my system offline here. We got two channels. Go see what's going on. Leak chamber. It's it's looks like it's online. Um, I can access the crafting terminal device online. It sees it. The storage bus is online. Hmm. Unless there's, uh, there could be some type of connectivity issue, like in the base, um, how the chunks aren't loaded. So that might be, you know, it could be what's going on. Uh, and possibly logging out, logging back in will fix that. Uh, but... <laughs> um, I don't really have the time to log out and log back in. Well, let me just go ahead and do it and see if it fixes it. So I'm going to pause the video right now. Okay, <laughs> it did not help it. It still mm -hmm. does not uh, see them in the system. So I'm just going to put them in my inventory and I'll figure it out later on, I guess. So, ooh, I don't know that I'll have enough slate for this. Oh, it's one for each. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to 
Well, it's like pulling them out. Yeah, I need a few more of those. So, um, man, I wish I could have gotten those all taken care of. Um, how about we go ahead and end the episode here and, um, I will finish getting ready the ritual stones and the master ritual stone, uh, to go into the demon realm in the next episode. Uh, cause then we'll have all the bits and pieces and we can spend the next episode exploring the demon realms. <laughs> okay. So anyway, uh, Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.